Yeah, unit three of uh, this model. Look at the modern marketing tools, and there are quite many. The market or marketing automation software. They track and respond to buyer behavior at every stage of the purchase process. It's almost like a research in a, uh, in electronic form. They install this uh, device in order to track their audience. Then you have social marketing platform, content uh, distribution, audience development. They get their message to the right people. Social marketing platform. They even market on all kinds of uh, 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 platforms like uh, even the, the Facebook, the, the Twitter. They sell things on WhatsApp, all these uh, uh, social tools. They distribute their content through these uh, avenues. They have the web. You know, uh, when people are doing business, it's advisable for them to develop their own website. Because when the people go there, if they are looking for you, if it is important, maybe you have marketed yourself or you're marketing yourself. They now, they want to, they require to go to your website to see everything there. The pages, the content, the access, the registration pages, the blogs, the resources, even the pricing details. When you are not able to deliver those, they go to people who are ready to do search for them. You have Salesforce automation software. That one, it gets visibility into opportunities and customers is critical for evaluating their marketing efforts. The software is very, is very, is very useful to the, for the to the marketer that is the entrepreneur then the content marketing software you you need content to share with buyer at, at the stage of the funnel because after everything is done being uh, said and done the the content will have to be developed whether the web platform whether the sales force automation, whether the social marketing, whether the automation software. For each one, you need a content. And somebody prepares the content. It is content that uh, is very uh, critical in understanding what you are doing. It's not everybody that is so used to the uh, computer and the electronic system. But the content, sometimes you take people to the content of the website, uh, what you are doing. He looks at the content and try to understand how it is done. And sometimes you have the dialogue-friendly uh, website. You get everything you need from there. Then all of the tools, the electronic tools, the software, they require content in one form or another. Your website needs content in order to attract customers. That's precisely what I was explaining, that they need the content to attract all kinds of customers. Because some people, even when you are selling to them, when there is adverts that pops up in front, uh, when you are browsing the internet, some adverts, they keep popping up. You are not interested. But when they refer you or when you get interested or when they refer you to the website when you go to the website you'll be able to understand the issue being discussed so uh, the, you, you, that's when you will now improve the value and generate uh, leads through form submission sales need content to be seen whether it is uh, where you do your blogging or dialogue, everything, including sales, they need content in order to be relevant. Until we see again, bye.